Hey, in this video I'm going to show you how to add a weapon system to your robot. So it's very similar to my first video about how to make a drive chassis. You want power going to a motor and instead of that motor spinning a wheel for motion, it's going to spin a weapon. There are many different weapons you can build for a combat robot. Um, some popular ones are flippers, grabbers, bar spinners, drum spinners. So in this video, I'm going to show you how I built the drum spinner for Mini Tento. How to build a robotic weapon system. All right, so this is the same diagram for the drive chassis. Um, we have power, we have a speed control a motor and the receiver. I will be taking my joysticks, my transmitter, and sending a signal to the receiver. It picks it up and it takes that signal and puts it into my speed control. From there, I have my battery plugged into the speed control going into it. And then depending on what sort of signal I'm sending the speed control, it sends a certain amount of power into my motor. So on the mechanical side, we have the motor and it's going to spin the weapon. Um, so this is a weapon blade, it's very heavy, and when it's spinning very fast and hits a very heavy robot, um, a lot of times what's going to happen is that blade's going to stop, it's going to stall, and if it was attached to the shaft of the motor, that force would go all the way into the motor and just totally ruin it. So we don't want to do that. How we save our own motor is to add some sort of slip into the system. This is the system that I like to use. It's a pulley system and I have a pulley attached to the motor with a V-belt that goes to another pulley which is permanently attached to my weapon. to build a robotic weapon system. <laughs> 